Alright, well, it doesn't matter how many trips it takes, we're gonna kill him. We're gonna kill him, we're gonna get a fucking drop this time. Oh my god, fuck off. Look, you get 50, 500s. Oh my god. Come on, give me something. Oh, I love seeing that on the ground, dude. Just look at that. Hey baby, it's Vidic here and uh, welcome back to Mage PS. In today's video, we are going to be destroying some high tier bosses with the new daily boss and boss task system. And we are also giving away 9 pet boxes worth about $100 in total. Pets are a huge part of Mage PS, which we'll see a little bit later. We're gonna have 3 winners, 3 boxes each. All you gotta do to enter is like the video, subscribe to my channel, turn on post notifications, and leave your Mage PS in-game name down below. And also make sure you enter on our last Mage PS video as well to double your chances of winning. Now really quick before we get into the slang, I just wanted to show you guys a couple of useful updates. You can actually do colon colon presets now. It'll open up a nice little system here. Let's see, click the empty preset. So we'll call this Elbermo. Okay, wait, I'm done. This is the inventory side over here, and this is the gear side. So let's rename this one to Elbermo. And there we go. Let's see if it worked. Stop fucking looking at me, Virtue. Are we naked? And give me my equipment. All right, there we go. That's very nice. By the way, there's over a hundred people online right now. You guys also might have noticed the home area changed a little bit. You got different zones now. You got shops over there. Pretty self-explanatory. Over here, you got these AFK zones, which we'll go over in another video, and the little skilling area. Down south is the C key and golden key area, and we're also going to be doing those boss tasks and the daily boss. And up here is a gambling zone. Like they got a boxing ring too. Oh fuck. Oh, we're gonna have to do it. What are we gonna gamble today? A Din's Bulwark. All right, guys, we're turning this into no less than four. No less than four Dinnies. Fuck. All right, no less than four blue lightsabers. Shit. That's the problem. We're getting high. We need to do that one. All right, Stormtrooper play body. I want no less than four. All right, so I've got a nice little assortment of goodies here. I've got four different pets we're going to use. I've got a weapon switch, and i got more in the bank. Now, you're going to go down south here. Remember, this is the gold key, crystal key zone. And these are your boys right here. These are the boys. So this is boss of the day, and this is pretty simple. Every single day, it's going to change to a different boss of the day. Now, what's good about this is you actually get double the boss points for killing the boss of the day. And there's some really, really good stuff from the boss point shop. This is where you can get some of these really OP potions, like double strength, range magic, cupcakes are like the best healing food, these gems can upgrade your gear, it's all good stuff. Also, as you guys know, a lot of bosses here on Mage PS have requirements of like other boss kills or NPC kills in total. So there's like some big boy bosses like Rage Virago, where you need 500 normal Virago kills, but if that boss ends up on the boss of the day, anybody can fight it without having to get the requirements. Alright, now this guy right here, we'll call him Jimmy. He is your boss task boy. So this is a really cool system. There's a bunch of different high level bosses on here. And once you kill 500 of them, you're actually going to get a bounty scroll for that specific boss, which is a guaranteed rare drop. So for example, you got the Satukre bot over here. I don't want to touch him or taunt him. You can check his drops with a right click. Ooh, yeah, one out of 20 only. He's got some pretty common drops. And then he's got the big boy drops, Satukre armor. A teddy bear shield. Oh my god, the bulwark is that rare? We, ga we gambled it away, guys. But yeah, as you can see, this stuff is pretty rare. It's obviously really good. And you're going to have to get really lucky to get one of these drops. But with the new boss task system, you kill them 500 times, you get the bounty scroll, and you get a free rare. And going back to the requirements thing, this is even more useful because some of these bosses are requirements for other ones. So you might have to kill Satukre 500 times anyways in order to get to the next boss. So now you might as well get a free drop out of it. So let's start off with the Corporal Beast really quick. He's not the super hardest boss. We've... We've done it before on an earlier video as well. These up here, I don't think we'll need the double strength potion, but let's drop Flambeed. Flambeed will actually shove a cupcake down your throat. Ooh, a little low. Every 15 game ticks, however many seconds that is. All right, come on Flambeed, give me a goddamn cupcake. Give me the cupcake, Flambeed. Flambeed! There's my cupcake, all right. Take a seat, idiot. Alright, very nice, you fucker. Oh, we got spin tickets, actually. Okay, I'm happy again. Um, let's actually see his drop is. We're not gonna kill Corporal Beast too much. We got a lot of other bosses to go out through. Look at those big boy spirit shields. Um, okay, let's use these spin tickets. Why the fuck not? I'm gonna spin all five times. 
We got a rubber chicken! Hell yeah! What is this? Oh. Okay. Alright, so for that kill, we actually got double boss points. So if you're looking for boss points, just kill the boss of the day. And you might also get a boss that uh, you can't normally kill. You might get a really good drop. So. Oh, and look, if I was smart. If I was smart, I would have looked at the personal boss task list first and then selected Corporal Beast. That way, when I was killing him with the daily. Uh, the boss task, daily boss. I would have been getting that kill count up, but I'm stupid, so I didn't do that. We'll start off with Krill. So you click select, and now you're hunting the Krill. So let's see, let's head over to the lair. This is actually like my favorite lair. I love this place. I don't know why. Let's look at this. Fuck. It's fucking intense. Uh, oh, hell chest and hell key and mystery boxes and spin tickets. This is my kind of boss. A lot of stuff, actually, for 1 out of 20. Very nice. Ooh, cupcakes as well. It's probably a good way to get those. Ooh, and these are the big boy bludgeon pieces, death kites. Deathful Kites, and Ku's Amulet of Torture Ore. Alright, bitch. I guess we go for the Soul Split. We'll go for the Flambeed again. Actually, no, we'll start off with Flambeed and see if he hits us. The Virago boss also has like a 10% chance. Ooh, somebody was already hurting him. 10% chance to like, double your max hit? Or something like that? Holy fuck, how much health does this guy have? How many zeros? 2 million? Oh no! Oh, I got the Cupcake in. Dude, he's hitting me so hard now. He went like, he's going like rage mode. Relax, dude, relax. Alright, we're gonna have to bring out the Hailstorm Dagger after this. That should be a lot better, especially with our soul split. There you go, you stupid. Really? These guys are actually really good. Like, every 10 seconds, I think it is, they'll deal like 10%. I think it's 1 to 10% of your max hit. This should be good with the soul split, though. Let's see if we can soul split our, keep our health good. Oh, no, no way. Alright, let's see if we can upgrade a little bit. I do have this, the Darth Vader set. 20k strength. Okay, our defense went up a little bit putting this on, so I'll take it. We gotta keep the sponsor cape on though, the thing's OP. And we got our red lightsaber, which is upgraded to level 9. Alright, I think we're gonna have to bust out the double strength potion. We have a double SS potion too, but I don't really want to use that yet. Uh, I, have, I have more strength ones. Alright, we get it for 30 minutes? Alright, well, it doesn't matter how many trips it takes, we're gonna kill him. We're gonna kill him and we're gonna get a fucking drop this time. Oh my god, fuck off. The 5500s. Also, we shouldn't really be using Orc Legion, we should be using Virago when we have the, the Elder Maul. Oh my god, you fucking piece of shit. Come on, give me something. You have so many 1 out of 20 drops, give me something. Oh, I love seeing that on the ground, dude. Just look at that. Look how beautiful that fucking gigantic open chest looks. Right? Like, just give me that. We don't even need a key, it's already open. Let's loot it. Yay! Alright, we got some hell power. Hell powder, we got some tuck to Zarg gloves. Alright, that's alright. Alright, I'm kinda curious about these bosses. Rage Virago and Diablo. Alright, we selected the hunt Diablo. This boss is actually really sick though. I also love where he is. Like, I don't know, look at this like negative to Zarg. Oh, there's somebody killing him! Iron Pog. What a fucking legend. She's got a pumpkin pet and everything. That's got like a 20% increased drop rate. Holy fuck. Okay. A lot of one build tokens. That's a lot. Okay, here we start going. One of the 15k. Holy fuck. This stuff must be rare. Hell Slayer Sword. I want that. And the Diablo Shield. I want that. Oh, TYB. Alright, he's gonna let me kill one of them. Being a nice guy here. He was protecting melee. I guess we just protect from melee. And maybe let's put on our faster attack speed. Set up. This guy's an Iron Man too, that's insane. Doesn't this boss require like 2,500 peak kills or is it 25,000? I don't know. Oh, get fucked. We only had to kill him like halfway. What did I get? What did I get? Food, class 5. <laughs> Unlucky. Yay, one Diablo kill count. Alright, let's check out Rage Virago. I've only fought normal Virago. Teddy bears. Oh, he has a lot of loot, actually. Auspicious. <gasps> That's like my favorite item in RuneScape. I want it. Let's see what the drop rate is. We're getting it right now. We got increased drop rate, like 160%. Oh, there's a lot of them. All right, what do you got for us, bud? I don't know how they have this. I don't really know how they have this many items in the game either. All right, well, I guess I'm hoping. I'm definitely hoping for the auspicious katana. They have a golden katana, but I want the auspicious one. Maybe flam bead for now. We don't know if we're gonna get take a lot of damage. Protect from melee as well. He's not that- he's just not that high HP. He's actually pretty low HP. Okay. Your attacks have no effect on this beast. Use your maul. I need a maul. Oh. Not this maul. 
Uh, Frenzy Maul? <laughs> Frenzy Maul? Is this the one? This is definitely the one we need to kill him. Use your maul. It says. Alright, bitch. Now you scared. Because we got what we, we need. It's not the Elder Maul. It's actually the Omens Maul. Which is from a quest. You can find it here under your, in your quest tab. It's actually here. Anyways, we're actually going to be able to kill these guys now. Get that old bitch. Hit him with the maul. Yeah. Look how he swings it. Alright. It actually looks like a fucking pretty sick item. I'm not going to lie. Look at that. Jesus Christ. What do we get? Hey, we got a hell key. Give me the katana, bud. Holy shit. 50 crystal keys. Holy crap. This would be a really good boss to kill for the boss task. Because they die really quick. Killing 500 of them wouldn't take that long. There's no respawn timer because there's so many of them. And his rare drops are super rare. Yeah, his rare drops like 1 in a 9k. I know I've just been using shitty tuna potatoes this whole time, because I like tuna and I like potatoes, okay? Don't be an asshole. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh my god, we got golden keys now. How many? 20! <laughs> Whack! And auspicious katana. Another hell key. Those stack as well. You're dead. Ooh, cupcakes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, yay! We're actually on a double drop rate right now. Somebody donated like a, a turtle or something. I don't know how it works. Open hell chest. Gimme. Two free slots. I'll take it. Ooh. Tiz. Tiz. Tuck Tazar cloak. Okay. We got two Tuck Tazar items so far. Oh my god. Stop it. What? 10? 25. Okay. Okay. One more. This is it. I can feel it in my loins. I can feel it in my loins. Rare drop. Right here. Right now. Bam. Fucking 10 magic. Oh, thanks. 25 magic logs. <gasps> oh, okay. Okay, I'm happy. I'm happy. We got six mystery boxes, baby. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. Alright, miss. Alright, mystery box. What do you got for me? <gasps> oh my god, it's a rare reward. Fuck yes. Now, you guys remember Star Wars raids? We did a video on them a little bit ago. I was never able to kill Darth Vader. Let's see what we can do. We can also do the cone cone bank thing and maybe cheat a little bit. That would be good. Now, I don't really know what pet to use. And should we protect melee? Probably protect melee. And we'll use a lightsaber. No, okay, we'll use this, the Orc Legion pet. Let's go, bitch. Little pussy boy. Fuck, is that 11 million HP? My god. Even with food, yeah, look at that. Even with food, we might not be able to kill him. Dude, relax, dude. Chill. Oh my god. I need like a thousand cupcakes. Or like more than one person. It's kind of, kind of what it's meant for. <laughs> fuck this. Fuck. Oh my god. <laughs> Come on, dude. Little bitch ass Obi Wan over here. Be easy peasy. Where is Flambeed? Am I blind? He's gone. Summon the Flambeed. Heal me, my son. We got way more potatoes. Ah! Come on. You got the power of the force on your side. Well, I got the power of anime on my side. Gimme, gimme. Damage dealt, 3.5 mil. We place first. Drop rate multiplier, whatever. Give me that fucking prize. Ooh. Alright, well. Should have got a lightsaber, but I'll take that. What you doing down there, right, you? <laughs> That's his pet. Alright, we got a purple party hat. We got a brutal whip. That's good. It's a good little starter weapon. A hell key. And five onyx. Alright, go fuck yourself. But anyways guys, I think that's gonna be it for today's video. We ended up just absolutely stunting on you guys. And yeah, boss the day, really OP. Today it's actually Corporal Beast, which I don't think has requirements. But other days it'll be a boss that has like insane requirements but has really good drops. Something like Rage Virago, which I was just killing and getting a ton of shit, you know? So definitely good to take advantage of that. And whenever you're bossing, just you know check out the boss tasks. Make sure that uh, the boss isn't here. If it is, you're definitely going to want to select it. Uh, that way you can start getting kill count for it to get a scroll, which will give you a free rare, no matter how rare it is. I think Diablo would be a really good one to do that on. Okay, I gotta figure this out. I think Diablo requires 2,500 kills. Oh my god, it does. So that's like, that's like the end game boss. That Iron Man had 25,000 NPC kills. What a legend. And by the way, I keep forgetting this. I only remember this at the end of the episode for some reason. The attendance checker. Make sure you come to this motherfucker every day. And you will get a free item. What do we get? Oh my god, we got Lucky Ore? Alright, we got Lucky Ore. 
That's pretty good. I'm pretty sure that's pretty. What the fuck? 2,500 one bill tokens? Double experience, double strength. Dude, this is actually really, really good. I saw somebody buying a double strength potion for 14 trill a little bit earlier. So you want to make money, just make sure you're on every day. And you get some good stuff. Turtle blocks? I think turtle stuff is pretty good as well. All right. Now remember, guys, we also got a juicy $100 giveaway. Nine pet boxes, three to each winner of three. All you gotta do to answer is like the video, subscribe to my channel, turn on post and notifications, and leave your mage PS in game name down below. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you're interested for more content here on Mage PS, just let me know in the comments below. Please like the video if you did enjoy. Subscribe to my channel for more videos. And have a nice day.